Well, what do you know, YouTube Rewind 2017 is here, and guess what, your main man, and now through the magic of editing, I am also on YouTube Rewind, so suck on that, YouTube. But, that's besides the point, uh, here's the, the, the cold hard truth of the fact is that I really don't like this YouTube Rewind. I really don't, and you might be saying, oh, corner, you're just hating because you weren't invited, yeah, because you have 40 subscribers, mmm, yeah, but how does that make my opinion worth less than someone with 10 million subscribers? Tell me how that makes my opinion worth less. My opinion means just as much as that, guys, and that's why I'm going to give you my opinion now. If you don't want to hear it, then you can click off the video now. Because I'm not going to hold back, I'm just going to rant for a bit, so yeah, just brace. Uh, so I was really looking forward to this actually, um, not because I was in it or anything, it's just because I really look forward to it every year. And honestly, in my opinion, and you may disagree in the comments, that's all, that's all fine. Everyone's entitled to their own opinion. Um, this is, in my opinion, the worst YouTube Rewind of all time. But, now I know it only exists for about five years, but I think I've watched enough of them <laughs> to the point where I can make a judgement. By enough of them, I mean all of them. And yeah, this really isn't a good one. It's even worse than the 2016 one. Mainly, in my opinion, because of the music. Um, 2016, while the video itself wasn't really that good, I really liked the music in it. That might just be because of my taste in music. I really like EDM, dubstep, all of that electronic music, you know, chain smokers, major lazy, you know, just go hate me for that right now. But I don't care if you hate me for that. It's my taste in music, so yeah. Um, yeah, the music mainly. You had Despacito, then you had Shape of You, then you had uh, Stay by Zed, and that's really the only three I can remember right now. Um, but yeah, that, that it was kind of a weird remix of all of those songs, which is always the case with YouTube Rewind. It's a mix of all so hit songs from the year. Um, but yeah, judging from YouTube Rewind, oh yeah, and Humble by Kendrick Lamar. Judging by YouTube Rewind, 2017, not good year for music, which is totally not true. It was a really good year for music. But hey, different people, different tastes, am I right? Also, the fact is that the video itself, in my opinion, is, isn't really that good. It's, 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 it's in many ways a step down from 2016. Um, visually speaking, like the gra not the graphics, uh, the effects. I don't know. I think the the 2016 video was was just a lot more flashy. A lot. It was just a lot more exciting, if you understand. Like compare this one to the 2016 one, and then just tell me that the 2016 one doesn't get you hyped. Yeah, people have said that it's bad and all that, but I honestly like it. And back then I didn't have like the point of view from a YouTuber's perspective because when the video came out, I, I wasn't a YouTuber. Um, and some people may say that I'm still not a YouTuber because I, ha I don't have a significant number of subscribers. So this video would probably never be watched by anyone who works at YouTube. But yeah. Now also, we've got to talk about the fidget spinners. Of course, they're in the video. And I hope they weren't. But I, I secretly knew that, yep, they're going to be in the, in the video. And when I first saw them, I was like, well, fucking done, YouTube. 
You fucking done it. You put fidget spinners in your fucking videos. There are millions of people are now going to see. And you're going to become the laughing stock of the internet. That might just be a bit over dramatic, but I'm trying to get my point across. Jesus. Hyperbolically, I'm trying to get my point across. Uh, I just hit my microphone. Um... Yeah, what, what else was in this video? Um, yeah, the YouTubers that were in it, I didn't recognize a lot of them. But, of course, I recognized, like, some of them, of course. That might just be because I don't watch a, a, a good variety of YouTubers. That's not true. I watch a good variety of YouTubers. It's just that those YouTubers, most of them, aren't big enough to be invited into for, for YouTube Rewind. Which is, you know, not very good because I really think that those YouTubers do deserve more recognition because they're really good YouTubers. So, yeah, I think I'll put a link to some of those YouTubers in the description if I don't forget it. Just they get some more recognition. Even though I have 40 subscribers, but I mean, every subscriber matters, doesn't doesn't it? Every subscriber is, in an, is a person, an individual with different opinions and all that. Yeah, you've heard it a million times before on this website. Um, but coming back to the YouTube Rewind. The conclusion of the video is really... Really, it just it it just comes to a stop. Just suddenly, it just stops. The whole video just suddenly stops and ends, which is a really weird way to end a video like this. It's legit like one second. It's like all music, fun, YouTubers are dancing around, and all of a sudden, boom! It stops. Music stops. Just. Halts like a train crashing into a wall. Train crashing into a wall. That's how quickly it stops. Oh, yeah, stops. Also, of course, we couldn't forget about, you know, TV, TV personalities also being YouTube Rewind. Emphasis on the YouTube part. And for some reason we have, who was it? Um, I think Stephen Colbert. In the video, uh, that might just be one of m a few of them, but I can't really remember at this point. If I find them throughout the video, I'll you know just point them out, like highlight them in the video, you know, editing stuff, you know, you'll see. Um, but yeah, let's see. If th is there anything else to talk about? Coming back to YouTubers. This, this might just be a pet peeve of mine, or a nitpick, or whatever you might call it. Um, I didn't see um, many gaming YouTubers. Like, for example, I didn't see Vanos Gaming. He might have been in it. I saw Markiplier. He was definitely in it. But then I didn't see uh, Jacksepticeye, which is weird. When you have a guy with... Let's see, how, how many subscribers does he currently have? Uh, let me quickly look this up. Jacksept guy currently has over 17 million subscribers. One of the most subscribed channels on this whole website. And he isn't in it. He was in it last year for like half a second. And I was like, yeah, they finally put him in it uh, to 2016. Now we're going to see more of him 2017. Ha, gotcha, psych, psych. Nah, he ain't in it. Nope, fuck you. Every single one of his fans just go fuck yourself. He might actually be in it, so feel free to call me an idiot. I didn't really look at the video too too much because I've just watched it and I just reacted to it. Like, you know how a normal person would. Didn't really notice all the fine details, which I will when editing this video. But yeah, I think this is going on quite a long time but I really just want to just get get these feelings off my chest and just tell you guys what I think about this now 
I actually, believe it or not, I wanted to be in this YouTube Rewind. Of course I was never going to be in it, because I, I have such a small channel. But I, I was like, yeah, I really want to be in it. I completely and utterly, um, what's the right word for it, uh, retract that statement now. I do not want to be in this. I, I wanted to be in it, now I don't. So it's a good thing that I wasn't. There were really only like a few settings to this YouTube Rewind. I think there was like f few settings. Maybe there might have been more, but they just re they just all look the same pretty much. Which is kind of weird for YouTube Rewind, which you'd imagine has quite a big budget since it's founded by YouTube itself, which is like one of the biggest companies or corporations in the world, at least on the internet. But yeah, I, I didn't make it. I'm not a director or a, uh, how do you say it, stage artist or, I'm not a professional when it comes to filmmaking, as you can probably tell from all my videos, but I'll learn in time. Maybe I'll get to direct YouTube Rewind at some point. That would be pretty good because I would make the best I would make the best director for YouTube Rewind. So YouTube, if you if you're watching this, hire me, okay? I'll do it for anything. I'll do it for free, honestly, just so I can work together with all these YouTubers. You know, hire me, um, or hire me as an extra in the background. I don't know. I just want to see all these YouTubers because f f fanboy, yeah. So yeah, um, I think uh, my ramblings have gone on for long enough. Basically, the gist of this video, if you've skipped to the end for some reason, is that this is a really bad and disappointing YouTube Rewind, in my opinion. In terms of music, in terms of... Uh, in terms of music, in terms of... What did I say? Uh, set design, I guess? I don't know, I'm not a professional, so... Feel free to, you know, tell me why I'm an idiot in the comments. So, if, if anyone actually watches this video, which is highly unlikely, which is why I'm just letting, just ripping this apart. Which is really weird for my channel, because I normally hold back quite a bit when it comes to topics like this. Um, but I just can't. Uh, because this is the pretty much the biggest event of in YouTube, like on YouTube in the whole year. And how you can fuck this up so bad and make it so boring and so disappointing and so bad is a mystery to me. Now, YouTube, if you don't like this, just delete my channel, okay? Just delete my channel if you don't like this. But if you do delete my channel, then please send me a personal email telling me why you did it. And then I'll probably respond to that. And guess what? I'll make a new channel. Not like I actually, you know, lost much from it. Am I right? You can't really hurt me financially or anything. Since I don't earn any money from this. So feel free to demonetize me all you want. I don't make any money from these videos anyways. They get like 5 views. So this might actually get more than 5 views for once. Because it's not actually just me pretending to be other YouTubers, which is not a good idea, because why would you watch me when you could just watch those other YouTubers I'm trying to imitate? Uh, but I think this is going off on a tangent now. Uh, that wasn't actually intended for this video. It's just because I've just let out all my feelings now. I've just felt like I'm going to bring up this topic. But thank you for listening to my ramblings. If you are still here, please, before YouTube deletes my channel, please leave a like, drop a comment, and subscribe. And I've been the Gaming Corner for possibly the last time in this channel's history, but I'm probably just being a bit overdramatic. But you never know with YouTube, do you? So yeah, um, just to repeat myself, I've been the Gaming Corner for possibly the last time on this channel. And I will see you in the next time if this channel still exists. I might not have been a YouTuber for a long time, but I think 
I have enough experience at this point that I can talk about YouTube Rewind at least. I'm not gonna go in and talk about the algorithm of YouTube like I'm actually I actually understand how it works or anything, but I think I'm qualified enough to talk about YouTube Rewind. Honestly, yeah, you've already heard what I think about it. So just uh, just just uh, let it just let it sit and just think about it. Okay, think about what I said. Just think, just just think about what I said. Okay, that's all I'm asking you to do. Like you can go in the comments, call me an idiot all you want. I won't delete any comments or anything. Like if you just like. Oh, you fucking asshole, YouTube Rewinds 2017 is great. Then I'd be like, well, fine, that's your opinion. But my opinion is that it's bad. So, but before you do that, please just watch this whole video. Just listen to what I have to say. And then you can go into the comments and call me an idiot all you like. All I'm asking you to do is to watch the video and just think about what I said.